Hey guys, I'm Samantha. Welcome to Top Dog Tips. This is our Chocolate Lab Sadie. And today we're going to be showing you guys how to remove hair from dog paws. So if you look, if you can see, and I'm going to show you close up in just a minute, Sadie's got some hair that kind of sticks out past her pads. And this is a bad thing because it can get um, dirt and debris stuff stuck in there um, and it can cause pain to your dog um, if you live somewhere we live in Maine so it gets very cold snowy and icy here in the winter and that hair can uh, build up snow and ice and and do some damage to your dog's paw too so it's important that you keep that hair trimmed and I do it when I clip my dog's nails it's the easiest way to do it every couple of weeks if it doesn't need to be trimmed that's fine but um, whenever you clip your dog's nails just go ahead and check that so now I'm gonna go ahead and show you what to do. So here we have Sadie's paw up nice and close and you can see that hair that's in between the pads that kind of sticks out a little bit. It's a little bit longer than her pads. Um, and this is really common in long haired breeds if you have a retriever, a golden retriever, or something like that, um, that happens. So anyway, what you need is either clippers, a small pair of clippers like this, or some scissors with flat blades. Um, you can buy professional grooming scissors. They cost a little bit more money, but of course they're made specifically to clip hair and they're nice and sharp. You want to make sure whichever scissors you're using that they are sharp because you want to do this as quickly as possible. Um, I recommend just clipping to where it's even with the pad, but if your dog has a mat in there, you're going to have to open the paw and um, you're going to have to get down as close to the skin as possible. You want to be very, very careful doing that because with sharp scissors or uh, trimmers like this, you can easily cut your dog's pad and you don't want to do that. So I will show you how I do it with the clippers um, and I just turn them on. Sadie's pretty used to them and I just go ahead and snip a little bit of that hair just very close to the pad um, and level that all up and then of course you can do it with the scissors too and I'll do this stuff with the scissors. Go on Sadie. I know I'm sorry. So all you do is just take them and very easily, Sadie, Sadie has a licking problem. You just clip that hair as close to the pad as you can. I use the trimmer because as you can see she doesn't like the scissors as much. It's something about the noise of the snipping. Um, and you want to get up in between the paws too. If you can see all that hair in between Sadie's paws, um, you want to just snip that down as much as you can. I'm going to go back to the trimmers just to show you how I do that. But you want to separate the toes and just trim that hair down a little bit. Going nice and slow. And you can get all the hair on your dog's paws. The longer your dog's hair, there might be some up top too that you want to trim. Um, so go ahead and just, uh, you know, flip your paws over like this. And if there's hair kind of coming up in between here, um, you can just go ahead and snip that too. So that is how to clip your dog's um, hair on their paws, how to how to trim the hair on your dog's paws. If you guys have any questions, be sure to email me. You can find my contact information on our website, topdogtips.com. You can follow us on social media or uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date with all my latest postings. And I will see you guys back next time. Thanks for watching.